back here inside the Wellness and Event Center. NJIT victorious over UMass Lowell by a score of 68 to 50. The Highlanders once again six and four in America East Conference play. A very big day for the senior in Kenna Squire. She's alongside Drew Casey, who of course is alongside the head coach in Mike Lane. We're here with Kenna Squire and head coach Mike Lane following an NJIT win. Coach, we're going to start with you. What was the halftime uh, message? You came out in the third quarter. You scored the most points in a quarter in all of conference play so far. I didn't know that. Uh, so, no, uh, the message was we didn't defend very well. Uh, their ball screens gave us some trouble. We kind of changed some of the matchups. Um, and I thought Aria Myers did a great job on Sanchez in that second half. Uh, at one point I told her, I'm like, if Sanchez goes out, you'll come out. But if she's in the game, you're in the game. And she's like, all right. <laughs> and that's what we needed. We needed somebody to just lock her down. She had a great first half. And offensively, the student athlete to my right, Kenneth Squire, had a fantastic game. But largely in the second half, she had 18 of her 22 in the second half. She's pretty good. Um, like she's really good when she's attacking and getting to the basket and being. She gets a, a look in her eye sometimes that she's going to the basket and scoring. And I think she's one of the best players in this league. Uh, I have to remind her of that sometimes from time to time. But uh, just a great kind of senior veteran effort there. Like we need, you know, it wasn't a pretty first half. Uh, we needed to get some separation, and we got that early in that quarter, and that gave us some confidence to get to the win. And Coach Lashley, you and I talk uh, have have talked throughout the year about free throw shooting and. You want to get there 20 times a game, and yeah. if you do that, you should win. You get there 24 times, and I think the best part is you made 20 of them. That's it was great, and uh, I know the Lowell fans didn't like it very much. Uh, it was pretty uh, loud in here, but that's how we have to have that attack mentality. We have to play through that contact. Uh, that's exactly how we normally play. That's how we played in years past. Um, so hopefully, if we can have that part of this game, or that part of our game in February, it's going to really help us in this stretch run. Well, Coach, thanks for your time. Congrats on the win. All right. Enjoy. <laughs> so Kenna's next here. Kenna, a game in which uh, we just chatted with Coach, of course. What was his halftime message, or what was the message and mood around the team in that locker room at halftime? Um, at halftime, we were definitely, you know, we knew that we could have been playing better basketball, and we knew that this is a team that they never stop, no matter what the score is. So the message was really that, you know, we could come out there and we could build that separation, but we know that no matter what the score is, they're not going to stop fighting, so we can't stop fighting either. You were a big part individually of, of that separation, 18 of your 22 in the second half. What allowed you and the team to, to get that separation on the court? I think that the second half, it was a full team effort. Um, you know, we were we sometimes get this like connection that we know where the next person's going to be. We know where the next pass is going to go, and we know that we're going to knock that next shot down. Um, and I think that the second half, we were just so connected. We had such good energy. Um, and I think that when we play like that, um, we're going to be the team to beat. We talked before the game, and it aired at halftime of today's broadcast. We were talking about high school quadruple doubles. Today you had a double-double. You had 10 rebounds. 22 points, 10 rebounds. Big smile there. Second one of the year uh, in, in that department. What is uh, doing it in a couple of other areas on the stat sheet to uh, say for you and this team? I think that um, for me, um, you know, the other things kind of lead to my scoring. So, you know, when I get rebounds, it gives me that confidence to score. Um, and I think that's something that um, is across the board with everybody, too. And it kind of just gives us everyone energy. We feed off of each other when we're, you know, filling up the stats like that. Well, Kenneth, thanks for your time. Congrats on the win. Thank you so much. Mike, we'll go back to you. All right, Drew, thank you very much. And that's going to wrap things up here from the Wellness and Event Center with